BAMOS project was funded under Horizon 2020 under the programme for ensuring that the European Union has access to critical raw minerals and to develop a new and innovative mining technique that the European Union needs. So the idea of the inlet submerged mining procedure is that you would excavate material on the pit floor and then pump it ashore. We are developing a prototype mining machine and to understand whether it's operationally viable we have to test it in an operational environment. We had a first trial in Leemore in Devon, so that was a great test of the positioning and navigational system because you can't see anything under the water at all. Coming here to Silver Mines we really wanted to test the cutability. We're cutting a much harder rock and that's why we've come here to this mine. We've got 16 partners from all over Europe and we're coordinating the whole research effort. We have designed uh, this robot, it's called EVA. You never know what you can find down there. So initially you need a high resolution map of the bottom. We use EVA for that. And uh, to be able to launch the mining vehicle, or to put the mining vehicle in the water, you need the dam launching recovery vessel. When that was finished, we were able to put the mining vehicle, to put that on board, which is weighing uh, 26 and a half tons. We really wanted to get a foot into the uh, submerged mining business and equip these uh, submerged units with our cutting technology. We basically provided the chassis the back stabilizer, the cutting arm, the cutter gears, cutter motors and of course the cutting head. We have data that's being collected by the underwater mining vehicle and from sensors that are on board the mining machine itself. And all of that data is being fused in the control cabin so that the pilot has a 3D uh, virtual reality view in real time so that he can see what's happening under the water and pilot the machine. So you, you cut the rock out of the ground and then it gets collected basically through the machine and then it's sucked up to surface, to the surface vessel and then later on on land. The collaboration with Sambic has been excellent. They've been providing the cut heads and um, obviously ensuring that that it fits in well with the whole design of the mining vehicle. And they've been very instrumental in making sure that components work together and they're a key partner in the project, so it's been great working with them.